New at 10 tonight, low income tenants and housing advocates are celebrating a major victory tonight in San Francisco. Supporters say a years old battle for more affordable housing ended in their favor. KTV's Amber Lee is live now at a development site to tell us what today's decision means. Amber. Heather, we're in the Mission District and supporters say this site, a largely empty building, will be developed into 100% affordable housing. They say the victory comes after a lot of hard work and never giving up. That is such an exciting step. Tenants and housing advocates held a celebratory rally at the BART Plaza on Mission at 16th Street in San Francisco. The victory is ours, the victory is in the community, and the victory is with the people. They say the victory means this site, 1979 Mission, will be developed into 100% affordable housing. Hope for tenants such as this single mom. My heart is very, very happy for family, for people. This part-time restaurant worker tells me she's raising two children. She says they can only afford to live in a single-room occupancy hotel in poor condition in the Tenderloin. With the help of a translator, she tells me this affordable housing project gives her hope. It would be like a dream for my children to have a bigger place to live. Maximus Real Estate originally proposed to build 331 units of mostly market rate rental housing on the site. Opponents called it Monster in the Mission and formed the Plaza 16 Coalition. They say their relentless seven year fight. I thank you for your attention today. Including a large turnout at a planning meeting in 2019 paid off. We had a thousand people at a hearing at Mission High School and that has never been done before. And that happened because community members showed up. Supporters say the new project will be similar to this 156 unit affordable housing just across the street from the site to be developed. It will be up to 300 units of one to three bedroom apartments. This project was made possible through a land transfer deal with the city. It was approved by the Board of Supervisors Tuesday. But the victory and the celebration is here with the community. You know, we give praise where it's due. Advocates estimate the project's cost to be close to $100 million. An estimated monthly rent could range from $460 to $2,000, depending on the tenant's income. They hope to break ground next year and complete construction in four years. Heather? All right, Amber Lee reporting for us there in the city. Amber, thank you.